If you're interested in becoming an electrician in California, your first step is to become an electrical trainee, eligible to work on job sites as you work towards your professional license. Keep watching to find out more about how to qualify for an electrical trainee card. Then you can begin your on-the-job training. Electrical Trainee 101 An electrical trainee is someone enrolled in a California-approved electrician trade school. These students are actively working towards their state electrician certification. Electrical trainees must enroll in a state-approved electrician program. Along with their regular electrician classes, some electrician training includes on-the-job experience. The California Labor Code allows electrical trainees to work on a job site for a C-10 electrical contract. The only way an electrical trainee can work on a job site is if they register with the state. To start this on-site experience, they must apply for their electrical training card. And in order to obtain this card, they must attend a school approved by the California California Department of Industrial Relations. An electrical trainee can enroll in a Department of Industrial Relations school, register for an ET card, and then can work full or part-time on the job supervised under a licensed electrician. The training process. California has created an electrician's registered electrical trainee process. Students must enroll in a classroom-based technical training program, such as through a vocational college or technical school. Many vocational and technical schools provide either residential or general electrical curriculum. The curriculum must align with the state's licensing requirements. These educational programs include classroom study requirements. These technical programs include both classroom lectures and lab time, and the programs usually take one to two years to complete. Vocational and technical schools usually provide placement assistance upon completion of their training programs. Until the graduate takes and passes the journeyman examination and accumulates the necessary hours, they'll be required to work under a state licensed electrical contractor. That's where they start the on-the-job experience required for licensure. Electrical Trainee Card After you submit your ET training program enrollment form and meet all entrance requirements, you'll receive notification from your school. This notification is your confirmation that you've been accepted in their ET program. After you've enrolled in an approved institution, you can then sign up for an ET card. Start by filling out the Application for New Registration of Electrical Trainee form. You also need to send a $25 check payable to the California Department of Industrial Relations. Students should also include a copy of their enrollment confirmation from the electrical school. Registered Electrical Trainee Once the state receives your application and school enrollment confirmation, they'll notify you that you are a registered electrical trainee. This notification will also provide you with a T identification number. This number proves that you are a registered trainee and enrolled in an approved electrical trainee program. When you've received an ET card, you're now qualified to work at construction sites as an electrical trainee. Certified electricians supervise electrical trainees. Electrical trainees can work with certified electricians on C10 electrical jobs costing over $500. Your next steps. To find an approved electrical school near me, head over to the Department of Industrial Relations website. They have a list of approved schools. Make sure you find a school that offers a whole general electrician curriculum. Once you're enrolled, you can apply for your electrical trainee card. Pull your materials together along with your enrollment confirmation and mail them to the address listed on our site. Don't forget to check our website to learn more about what you should know about this career field. Check out our trade and vocational school programs online. We're here to help you kick off your next best career. And if you enjoy this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.